hey what's up i will show you now a way that we can have multiple output paths so by default webpack only allows us to have one output path it's on our test at the moment but my end goal to have a css folder and a javascript folder inside our test so there is actually a hacky way to do it and i will show it to you we can if you remember these files will be outputted or these keys will be the name of our files that will be outputted it turns out if you added a path here we'll back will resolve that so let's put javascript then for the slash main javascript for slash about css for slash main and let me remove everything so my disk is now empty so let's run that So as you can see, we have now two f two folders in the disk, one for the CSS, one for the JavaScript. Um, maybe not the best way, but it's really hacky. Another recommendation I will give you to do this is to have multiple webpack files, one for SAS, one for JavaScript, one for whatever, anything else you have. Uh, if, if you combine everything together, this will be very long, maybe reach three, 300 lines. So this is a topic for another video, but yeah, this is my uh, recommendation. But if you are working on a small project, this will be fine. Okay, thank you. Bye.